Hello and welcome back to Sherwood Park Toyota. Today we're looking at a BMW 428i X Drive in the color white. Let's take a look. So starting up front underneath the hood, you have a turbocharged two liter four cylinder engine. Automatic transmission gets up to 240 horsepower, 255 pound foot of torque. Up front LED headlights, customary daytime running lights, fog lights down below. Across your front bumper, you have these little round nodules. Those, of course, are your front parking sensors. As you get along to the side here, you'll find a little camera on the side contributing to the surround view camera effect. We also have your 18-inch alloy wheels. Side mirrors have integrated turn signals and blind spot monitoring. Then as we move back, on the right-hand side up top, you have your 428i badge. On the left, you have the X-Drive badge, and then all the way across your rear, you have more parking sensors. Underneath your rear logo is your backup camera. This is also where you reach to release your trunk. Simply press the little button, and it should pop right open. Inside here, we have tons of storage space. On either side, we have extra deep wells you can see are currently holding extra accessories. On the left, we also have an additional power outlet available. For your second row seats, we do have triggers available through the back in order to fold down the coordinating seats in order to extend your cargo, cargo space forward into your cab. There are also tie-down hooks, as you can see, throughout your rear space. If you're looking for your kit for your tires, simply look down and find a little notch in the false floor. Lift that up, and everything you need will be stored underneath. Now to close up your rear space, simply reach up and bring down the trunk to lock it back into the starting position. Next, let's take a look at the inside. So inside here, your interior upholstery is the red leatherette with black stitching. In order to get access to your second row seat, simply release the trigger on the top outside corners. You can also use these buttons to additionally move the seats to have a better access. Second row seat occupants have access to the folding down armrest slash cup holders and a little cubby space underneath. And then on the back of your console, you have your air vents and a 12 volt adapter. And on the back of both seats, you do have a mesh pouch storage available. And we currently have the BMW carpet mats throughout the back. Then you can simply fold your seat back and then use those controls again or use the electronic seat adjustment on the bottom, back front, up, down, lumbar support, and then the two, one, and set is your memory seat settings. On the door, you have your window controls and side mirror controls, including this little button. If you give that a press, it will allow you to fold your mirrors in flat with the body of your unit. Press it once more to have it return to its original setting. We also have your speakers available here and storage space down below. Now underneath is where you have your hood release and your trunk release. You then have all of your lane departure sensors and headlamp controls as well as dash brightness controls. Taking a look at your steering wheel here, up top you've got your parking sensors, down below you have your cruise control, then to the right you have your mode for your main display for your radio and it will pop up on your heads-up display there as well then you have your volume and hands-free communication as you saw we do have this little cutout and the display that is your heads up this way you can keep an eye on your pertinent information without taking your eyes off of the road just over from this is where you have your infotainment display screen but as you can see there's not a whole lot of controls the control for that is your little control down below you have a fully tilt controls as well as dial and then the buttons for all of your main setting options so taking a look at this starting out up top you have your multimedia radio phone navigation office connected drive vehicle info and settings for your multimedia and radio and audio listening, that includes AM, FM, and satellite radio, full Bluetooth connectivity, and optional USB adapters. Then you have your navigation that you can fully control to your own specifications. And then your telephone, of course, goes through Bluetooth to your personal device. Underneath that, you have your four ways and window lock, and then further controls for your radio, as well as the CD player right in the middle there. Volume control on the left. To the left of that, you have your push start ignition, and then your automatic on off. Underneath is your climate control center. We have dual climate control in here so that you and your front passenger can have your own 
unique temperature settings. And then you also have three variant levels for heated seat controls, defrost for front and rear windshields. Underneath that, you have all of your storage space, including the little cover for the cup holders up front here, where you have another 12 volt adapter. Behind that is your gear shift. If you're unfamiliar with the style of gear shift, it does have the little display and you use the trigger on the side in order to move through your different modes. Then next to that, you have your traction control, your sport and eco pro parking sensors. And then this is for your surround view cameras. So if you're parked, you can give that a press and it will give you a view around yourself so that you don't have to worry about shifting your car to reverse or drive in order to see around. Press it once more to make it disappear. Then just back from that, you have your parking brake. Then you have your console. You've got your key inside here and then your snap-in adapter for your phone so that it doesn't go flying around when you're driving. Behind that is where you have your aux and USB adapters. On the right hand side of your dash, you have a lockable glove box. Then on your rear view mirror, you have these three little buttons. Those are garage door openers. Above that, overhead lighting control, SOS button, and controls for your moonroof. Thanks again, folks, for joining us on this full video tour for this BMW 428i X Drive in the color white. It is located here at Sherwood Park Toyota at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta. You can also reach us at 780 306. 7703. And remember, life is full of choices. Let us be yours.